Good evening. We begin with breaking news out of the southern tier where state police have captured this teenage boy who was wanted in connection to a deadly fire. Police caught the suspect, William Larson Jr., late this afternoon. Now, authorities identified him as a possible person of interest shortly after responding to the fire in Clarksville this morning. Inside of the home there, police found two bodies. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ed Riley is live in Allegheny County tonight with new information from police. Well, Keith and Ashley, that's correct. Police confirmed just a short while ago that they do have William Larson Jr. in custody. The teenager was found alone and not far from his home in Clarksville. Now, this was a very intensive search by authorities, but with a suspect on the loose, it also put a lot of people on edge. In the same general area in the town of Clarksville where we had been searching for the subject since earlier this morning. He was taken into custody without incident by one of our patrols. Dozens of New York State troopers and state forest rangers spent the day searching for 17-year-old William Larson Jr., an effort that paid off shortly before 5 p.m. would like to uh, take this moment to thank the community for their understanding and cooperation. During the day-long search, many, like Debbie Walsh, who runs a small deli in West Clarksville, were very concerned about their safety. He's got to be scared himself too. So when a person gets scared and backed into a corner, what are they going to do? Archie Moorhead received a late night phone warning from state police. I guess I won't be wandering through the woods anymore because I don't live any close. I don't live close by any neighbors. So did Tanya Evans, who was taking no chances. I'm concerned. You know, I'm concerned for the family. I feel bad for the family, the first responders. The incident started after midnight when the Clarksville Volunteer Fire Department responded to a call of a small fire in a home on Courtney Hollow Road. They were met by 17-year-old William Larson Jr. Firefighters then discovered there were two bodies inside the residence. Prior to our patrol's arrival at the scene, the subject that who also resides at that residence, left the scene. Using foot patrols, canines, drones, and a helicopter, police have conducted an all-out search for Larson. We are looking to locate him to confirm if he is safe and to interview him regarding this incident. Police have not identified the deceased individuals or said what caused their death. Since there were weapons found in the home, police were warning the public to not approach Larson. And the whole event was very nerve wracking for the small communities of Clarksville, Obi, and Cuba. Worried, worried, and um, paying more attention to your surroundings. Now that he is in custody, police plan to interview Larson to find out more about that suspicious fire where the two bodies were found. And earlier today, three school districts in this area were closed because of safety concerns during the search. But state police tell us at this point, all shelter in place orders are lifted. Live in Allegheny County, Ed Riley, 7 Eyewitness News.